The Republican primary in South Carolina is just nine days away, and the attacks are getting louder and cruder. Here's Major Garrett. We win here. We're going to run the table. Donald Trump in here, South Carolina by turns here. optimistic Let's and vulgar. And say, what the hell is this guy talking about? I didn't know what the hell I was doing. What the hell are we thinking? Senator Marco Rubio. Marco Rubio campaigning in a state with more conservative cultural instincts criticized Trump's language as an assault on decency. You turn on the TV, you have a leading presidential candidate saying profanity from a stage. Profanity from a stage. I mean, all these things undermine what we teach our children. Jeb Bush also piled on. He says, we're going to bomb the blank, blank, blank out of ISIS using a vulgarity. That's not leadership. In 2012, about two-thirds of Republican primary voters in South Carolina described themselves as evangelical or born-again Christians. <laughs> presenting a challenge for Trump despite his large lead in the polls. Voters we spoke to here were divided. Just the way he carries himself and when he claims me a Christian and you can only quote one verse out of the Bible, I mean, come on. I think, you know, that's what a lot of people like about him is he, he says what he means and means what he says. I love it. Trump today pulled an ad criticizing Ted Cruz and said he would only run positive ads from now on. Scott, John Kasich's campaign has been doing that for weeks and described Bush's efforts here in South Carolina as having all the joy of the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Thanks, Major.